Rogers Show. Starring Roy Rogers, King of the Cowboys, Trigger, his golden palomino, and Dale Evans, Queen of the West. With Pat Brady, his comical sidekick, and Roy's wonder dog, Bullet. Pat, I just stopped by Tom Wyman's place. He's been shot. I know. The doctor says he has a good chance of recovery. Does anyone know who did it? Well, I don't even Sheriff knows yet. Well, it won't hurt to ask him. Wait a minute, Roy. Reverend Osgood is expecting you at the meeting. What'll I tell him? Well, tell him I'll be there if I can possibly make it. All right. We'll have to hurry, Pat. Oh, there's plenty of time. Just feel that muscle. I felt it ten minutes ago. Come on. Oh, gee whiz, with all that exercise I've been doing to keep myself strong, I've well, got to have some encouragement. Going to meeting. Every place in town is closed tighter than a drum on account of that meeting. Meeting and no meeting. We better get some gruff of Vicar. He's going to be sore. Hey, hey, come here. That's old Lord Turner's donkey. Who's Lord Turner? That prospect I met a while back. Friend of Roy Rogers. Boy, you take the sack and sneak in that side door. I'll wait for you. Nothing more edifying than a good summer. There certainly isn't. Puts you right with the world the rest of the week. Boy, I think I'll go over to the doctor's and see how Tom Wyman is. I'll meet you back at the cafe. All right. I'll go change into my work duds and open her up. Killed by the North Trail. The landslide covered it up. Huh? But I know an old Indian path you can use. Good. Them directions are sort of confusing, Roy. I think I'd better draw a map of it. All right. Put it on the back of this menu. Nope, I'll put it in the book. Then he won't get lost. You know, Lode, the key to the biggest treasure of them all is hidden in that book. That's the fact. More real gold than is ever found in these here hills. A ghost of Pat Brady. Come on out, Pat. We know you. Pat. Pat. What happened? The roof fell on me. Come on over here. Hey, Sheriff. I want to ask you something. All right. No, look at it. Yeah. What's the matter? 
slug. That's what happened. Me, Samson Brady, slug from behind. Pat! Oh, you poor boy. Or somebody lowered the boom on me. I'm sneaking out of the restaurant. We better see if we can pick up the trail. See you later, Dale. Be careful, Roy. Pat! You're all right, Pat? Hey? Yeah, I'm all right. Only somebody keeps turning out the lights. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, Sheriff. What's up? Any trouble at the hideout? No, but your army's been gone so long, I thought I'd better find out what happened to you. We ran into Roy Rogers. Roy Rogers? Yeah. He and the sheriff are bloodhounding on our trail. We better head to that skyline. Hey, Vic, wait a minute. We gotta get back to town. To town? You eager for a rope next time? No, we gotta get a book. A book? Now I know you're local. It's not an ordinary book. It's got the key to a hidden treasure in it. What are you talking about? Floyd saw Lord Turner drawing a map in it. And he told Rogers there was more gold there than in any strike that had ever been made. Well, if it's that good, it might be worth a chance. Is Rogers headed up this road? If he's tracking us, he is. And we didn't stop to wipe out our tracks. We better follow the dry wash back to town. Otherwise, he might bump right into Rogers. And that's something I ain't hankering to do. You're overdoing this a little. Yeah. Well, I'm tired of being pushed around. Before I'm through, I'm going to show a couple of fellas in this here town a big surprise. And this here book guarantees you to look just like that in 20 easy lessons. Well, shucks. I've only been at it for three days on that stuff over there. And already my biceps are a bulging. If you're aiming to lift this bar, you'll have to grow a new pair of arms. Well, load, you don't lift all the weights at once. You sort of start with two and work up to them, like uh, lifting a calf every day until it grows into a cow. Pat, instead of juggling those things, why don't you try juggling a couple of plates? Poor load here is hungry. All I need is a little salt, and I'll start chewing my tongue. <laughs> Just for load left. Who was that? Must have been some fella looking in. Open ear, open for business. I wish it was that fella that slugged me. I'd take him apart with my bare hands. dishes we won't have to wash. Or I mean, I won't have to wash. I... Which way are we heading? We better not go back to the hideout. Wait. The trail is here. Which makes the hideout the safest place we could find. Right here on the counter. Oh, I can't imagine what in the world could have happened to it, Lode. 
Well, hello, Roy. Hi, Dale. Did you catch the outlaws? No, but it was the Castle Gang, all right. There were three of them. We trailed them back to town. They haven't been here again, have they? Someone did come in. My good book's missing. Missing? I'll bet them crooks took it. Nonsense. Well, nothing else has gone, not since they pinched the cash in the grub. Now, what in tarnation would they want with my good book? Maybe they needed some reading matter. This has got me dumbfounded. We better do some more checking, Sheriff. Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, Deuter, Deuter Omoni, Moni, Money. Did you find a key to hidden treasure yet? Oh, shut up. Get back the window. What you getting excited about? We covered up the tracks, didn't we? Maybe and maybe not. I don't put nothing past a guy like Rogers. The map don't tell us nothing. Just a lot of wiggly lines. Take us a whole year to get through this book. But how are we going to find the key? I'll tell you how. We'll bring Lord Turner here and make him find it for us. That's a good idea. Why didn't you think of that before? Which way are we going to take? Maybe Rogers will be coming up the dry wash. He might be coming up the back road. Well, let him. We'll take the shortcut over the hill. Well, there's no sign of him back on the road. No. Looks like they used a brush drag to wipe out their trail. Well, ain't that just fine and dandy? Nothing but a prairie dog. And all the tracks are here. And they're heading towards the hills. What is it, Roy? What's the matter? They're going back to town. There must be something mighty important back there to make them take a chance like that. Can't you ashamed yourself stealing the duck is done up? <laughs> when Lode comes to see how his donkey's enjoying his dinner, finds it's been stolen, he's going to follow that scattered hay right into here. And all we do is grab him. <laughs> <laughs> grab a hold of this, Hank. Trying to pull it. Hey. Hey, that's all right. It's like pulling taffy. Yeah. I'll get it back for you. Oh, here it is. If I ever find out... Off the back door. They what? Well, why would anyone want to kidnap Lowe? If they wanted somebody to read the good book to him, why didn't they take the parcel? All I know is he went out to see Get Along. And we found evidence of someone being dragged out through the back door of the shed. And three sets of boot tracks heading towards... Uh, don't tell me. I know. Back the way we came. Roy, I've got some business to attend to at the jail. All right. I'll go ahead and you can catch up with me. I'm going with you, Sherry. Yeah, not without me and Nellie Bell.
He ain't come to yet. No, and if I throw any more water on him, I'll drown him. Why'd you have to hit him so hard? I didn't. I only tapped him. Oh, you probably gave him percussions of the brain. He ain't gonna never come to you. He's got to. How are we gonna find the key to the hidden treasure? Roy Rogers said it was in the book. All right, all right. Boys, you stay here with Logue. Me and Hank will go back and get Rogers. Pull up, Rogers. That's as far as you're going. Now get down off that horse and do it real slow like. You're gonna get your hands up. Nice work, Hank. Well, you didn't know I had a card up my sleeve, did you? That card just happened to be Hank. Listen. So the sheriff's coming, huh? And your friend's with them. Well, we'll give him a little surprise for him. Shut it up so he can't shove. Not like that. You put him out like you did loads. All I want you to do is just to hit him with your fist. Like that. Roy! Yeah, Roy. Don't try anything. We rode right into a trap, we did. Just like a bunch of blundering tender feet. How is he, Dale? He's unconscious, but his pulse is strong. You want me to tie her up? Uh-uh. She's going to persuade Rogers to tell us where we can find that key. We found the map, but we haven't found the key to the hidden treasure. What key? I don't know what you're talking about. You said the key to the biggest treasure of all was hidden in this here book. Oh! oh <laughs> What's so funny? Nothing. Nothing at all. Boyd heard you say the key was in the book, and you can't deny it. I wouldn't if I could. It's true. There is treasure in that book. The greatest treasure in the world. You see? You want to tell you. Real gold? I'd say so. Not the kind you think. I don't care what kind it is. That's nuggets of cash. I want it. Now, you better tell us where we can find it, or do I have to rough up your little friend here? All right, but I'll have to show you. Untie my hand. Oh, no. He's got a sock like a mule. Oh, don't worry. Me and Vic will protect you. The key is in the story of David and Goliath. Huh? I'll tell you what, you be Goliath. Uh, who's Goliath? Well, he was the hero of the Philistines, a big man like you. And no one had ever been able to lick him in a fight. <laughs> now we're getting someplace. There he stood, clad in armor, shield in one hand, and a spear in the other. Well, look like a conquering hero. Hold your head up like a real hero. That's better. Now, you two fellas come on over here. Hank, you're the captain of this great army. You stand right about there. And Floyd, you're little David. You're going to play that part. You see, the lie that challenged David to a fight. And David was just a shepherd boy. wasn't very big, so he took his slingshot, put a big stone in it, and whirled it around and around and around and let Goliath have it. David did? Yeah. Ah! Now, what's the rest of the story? Yeah, what happened? Well, you see, David being small, he didn't... Yeah. I guess he didn't know about my biceps. Never mind that. Get me out of this harness. Oh. Are you all right? Yeah. Oh, my head. Nice work, Roy. You might at least have waited till I could take a poke at him. I'm sorry, Sheriff, but I didn't have time. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Bullet. And I don't need this anymore. What's the matter, Pat? Have you given up the idea of being a strong man? Well, did David go around bulging his biceps when he smitted Goliath? No, sir. 
He just smitted him and he stayed smoked. Exercising's a lot of fun that makes you healthy, but Chuck, I don't need all this stuff just to punch somebody in the nose. <laughs> like the parson said, strength is not of the body, but of the spirit. Yes, he who is strong in spirit, having honor and uprightness in him, shall prevail. That's what I mean. Didn't I flatten old Floyd Newton? You sure did, Pat. Watch this, Roy. <laughs> anything heavy again as long as I live. Whew. Oh, oh my gosh, I'm ruined. I'll be looking at my boots for the rest of my life. Oh. Pat. Oh, this could be serious, Dale. Maybe we ought to call a doctor. Yes. Yeah. Happy trail. 